Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to another roasting session here in my roasting pit. Today's crackhead that will be roasted by yours truly is Gregory Burlington, or as I would like to call him, Greg Head Burling Knot, or shall I say, Dickhead Burly Knot. Because this loser, this insignificant loser, was on Eric's live stream claiming that I was nothing more than a hologram. Well, Greg Burlington, or Dickhead Burling Knot, does it explain anything that I'm made of flesh and blood? And you have the nerve to call me nothing more than a hologram? Hmm? Well, what about the fact that I have many other hobbies and many other interests that range from the arts all the way up to music, all the way up to martial arts, as well as vocal music? Does that make me a hologram? Does that make me nothing more than a robotic hologram, as you would like to formulate it? No. I am a living human being with a whole lot to give to the world and with a whole lot of conscience on me, let alone someone with an actual functioning brain, unlike you are dickhead burling knot because you've proven yourself to be nothing more than an insignificant and absolutely tasteless curmudgeon who just spits on the joy of people who are truly living beings and i'm starting to think that you are nothing more than a little basement dweller let alone a little basement troll just typing everything on your keyboard with your stubby, fat fingers compiling baseless lie after baseless lie just to make yourself look and feel better. Well, Gregory Burlington, aka Dickhead Burling Knot, I'm going to tell you exactly who you are. You are a pathetic basement dweller who does nothing but unleash baseless claims after baseless claims to people who, mind you, are not holograms. They're real people. And yes, I know that AI has been defecating on everything that is otherwise natural, let alone everything that is supposed to be man-made and everything that is made by everyone's own special hands and own special skills. In fact, I'm going to give you a taste of reality that I'm sure that you would love to see from me. Do you see this drawing? Now, I know that you're probably not going to see this and think, oh, it's AI. Well, you crackhead, it ain't AI. This is pencil and paper let alone sketch paper that I have done specifically of Ayame in my AU headcanon being the absolutely formidable fighter queen that she is with Inuyasha in my AU headcanon being the strong muscle dude king that he is. And of course, I'm about to complete her trophy, which is a figure of a Nakmoi doing his Muay Thai pose. And of course, those of you not in the know about my AU headcanon for Inuyasha and Ayame, they're both yokai martial artists specializing in their respective martial arts. What with Inuyasha being a pro wrestler specializing in Pankration and Kapukoya Lua and Combat Sambo, but primarily Pankration. And he's also a bodybuilder just to also complement all that muscle. And Ayame is a kickboxer who specializes in Kyoktoki and Muay Thai as her primary martial arts. So there you go. That's your proof that I am not a hologram and that I am a real person with a lot of crazy things going on in my mind and a whole lot of creative ideas just flowing 
through this thing called a brain. So, Gregory Burlington, if it's not enough to satisfy your pathetic little ego that I am not a hologram or that I am a quote-unquote hologram, I don't know what is. Because it seems to me, Mr. Burlington, that you are a basement-dwelling loser with no job, with no prospectus for a future, and you just want to make all these stupid baseless claims because you are a rat-infested little troll. Yeah, that's right. I would hate to see you. I would probably hate to see your house. I'm pretty sure that it's so full of rats just coming out of your little basement. And I'm pretty sure that you're hiding behind your parents. And I'm starting to think that your parents probably might have anything to do with you anymore, even though you claim to be on your own. Well, whatever you are, Gregory Burlington or dickhead burling knot, you are certainly nothing more than a sad little curmudgeon who just cannot accept reality and wants to live in La La Land forever. Well, guess what, buddy? You can live in La La Land all you want. But let me tell you something. Once you get a harsh dose of reality, you're going to be faced with a lot of people who you have hurt and you have been dragging down the mud with your stupidly baseless claims and all of your lies, and they will be exposed unto you. The person who's going to end up being at the receiving end at all of this shit is you, Mr. Burlington, because the fact that you dared to type down in the comment section, let alone in the live stream chat, that I am nothing more than a pathetic hologram just goes to show you that you are nothing more than a baseless and truly stupid, insipid, and horrible basement dweller who just loves to make up a whole bunch of lies and doesn't even want to face reality. Well, Gregory Burlington, once you start facing reality, you're going to be greeted by a whole bunch of backlash. And it's all because of your lies. It's all because of your own baseless stupidity. And that's quite sad, isn't it? You just love to shit on people and shit on those who actually have a life and say that they're nothing more than holograms. Listen, buddy. You're looking at a guy who has been through high school hell when I was a teenager. You're looking at a guy who has been through a lot of very triggering moments with a lot of my former batchmates, let alone a good number of them, who chose to take the mickey out on me and tried to break me just because I wanted to be everybody's friend. Well, you're also looking at a guy who's also had to face that reality that I can never be everybody's friend, but be very selective of the people that I choose to be friends with. Does that make me a hologram? No, that doesn't. That makes me an actual human being with real emotions and real sentiments and real objectivity just flowing not only my mind, but also my heart and soul. Unlike you, Gregory Burlington, you are nothing more than a stupid curmudgeon who chooses to make yourself look big because you want to make people feel small and make them feel like they're nothing more than so-called holograms. Well, how about I tell you this? You're the real hologram, Gregory Burlington. You're the real, poorly made hologram, made out of rats, made out of viruses, and made out of a lot of flesh-eating amoebas that just defecate at everybody at every single opportunity. How does that make you feel, huh, Gregory Burlington? How does that make you feel? I'm pretty sure that will make you feel lousy. I'm pretty sure that will make you feel like a piece of crap. And that's what you really are, Gregory Burlington, or dickhead Burling Knot. You are 
a weakling. You are a true weakling, Gregory Burlington. And for that, your parents must be so proud of you for being this weak ass, pathetic little punk who spreads baseless claims after baseless claims that anybody who is real is nothing more than a hologram. Well, I hope you have fun down there in that basement, let alone cellar you call your quote-unquote home, Gregory, because once it all starts bouncing back on you, you'll never escape from it. So, Gregory, I hope you have a fun time just experiencing all the shit that you've been saying to other people, and may they all come back to you, and they will come back to you in an acidic fashion. And as for everybody who has been tuning into my roasting session with this time Gregory Burlington, I hope you all have a lovely day.